Welcome back to Inspools. It looks like ALF has been on a 100% breakout today. So I'm going to go over a quick analysis on what exactly has to happen for ALF to continue and exactly where we alerted this one in the Inspools room. So let's jump right into this one. So I'm going to go to the 15 minutes with you guys here and exactly what might happen going into tomorrow and how this one played out today. So you guys can see here, we had our major breakout point here at 925 because we did get previously rejected exactly at this point. And again, 925 was very key for us as we have been consolidating and we have the 20 May that did curl back up and we were looking to see if the 20 May would curl up and sure enough, it did. You guys can see we did have this major breakout above 925 and you guys can see we have been on quite the breakout again. We went up about 60% today. I'm going to show you guys exactly where we did alert this one in the insoles. And again, if you guys want to see all these pennies stock breakout alerts throughout the day go to instables.com that is in the description below and we did alert this one throughout the day again this was a 60 percent breakout this was our major breakout of the day alf was mentioned here in the morning at 6 33 when market opened um, at ten dollars and again ten dollars was a major resistance and we did break above it and sure enough we have been continuously breaking out since then again um, breaking new highs above 1050 after the halt and we have been breaking out since then so again um, alf was a 60 percent breakout you guys can see here even going into after hours that we did mention that it was at 1670 so again um, ever since our $10 um, resistance that we did mention, it has broken out 60% since then up to around 1670. So I'm going to go back to the 15 minute with you guys here and show you guys exactly what might happen going into tomorrow. So again, we did mention ALF multiple times. We we're up about 60 to 70% today on the day. But however, um, we did take a lot of profits like I did mention. And we're going to be looking to see if this one can continue with the 20MA curling back up with the candle staying above it with the 50MA being below the 20MA, of course, like usual. Um, if we can get that continuation, then we could see a healthy chart and a possible continuation. But I definitely would be careful. Again, um, we do see a lot of volume that has been coming in, but I'm going to back up here for a second on the four hours so you guys can see exactly how much volume we do have. So again, um, you guys can see here that the volume has been coming in. We have as much volume as we did previously on this breakout. And so we're going to be looking to see if we can break above it. If we do get rejected and for some reason get a huge red candle, then we could possibly get rejected and sell off tomorrow. But however, today we had a major breakout and um, we do have about 200 million volume ending the day. So we have a ton of volume that has coming in. We'll definitely keep ALF on the watch. But however, I did want to mention the 60 to 7 percent breakout that we did have in the Instables room. So you guys can see exactly what it looks like. But again, I do appreciate all the love you guys have been showing me in the comment section. As always, I appreciate everybody that's been supporting the channel. You guys have been amazing. Um, if you guys do like this video, it does help other people find it and it does help the channel grow. And I do appreciate it very much. And God bless you all. And I'll see you guys in the next video.